This is Human Resource Machine, a coding game that's been driving me crazy for quite some time now. It's ridiculously complicated. Which level do I go for? Let's go 21, why not? I don't remember the previous stuff anyway. Okay, cool. So in this job, we believe in educating our employees. Do you know what a zero terminated string is? Well, my first instinct was no. And then I thought it's a string ending with a zero. A very old technique, okay? So let's see what the task is. The inbox is filled with zero terminated strings. What's that? Ask me, your boss. Oh, shut up, you. Add together all the numbers in each string. When you reach the end of the string, marked by a zero, put your sum in the outbox. Reset and repeat for each string. Is it just me or is that really simple? Basically, what we need to do is take a number from the inbox, then add it to this zero, which we have here. And what happens then? Yeah. Okay, put it on the ground. Let's call that a sum. So we're gonna have the sum here. And then you're gonna keep taking more numbers, adding them to the sum and writing them down again. You repeat this forever, but at some point you pick up a zero and that's when you want to break that loop and just take from the sum and outbox that and repeat again. There. Now this won't work if there's only one number between two zeros. Because we inbox, copy, inbox again and then start adding. So I have another plan. But first let's see if this works at least a bit. Put the 4 down, take the 9, copy that together, place it down, take the 0, you see it's a 0, so you take the 13, outbox that and repeat. What's gonna happen between these zeros? Should I just output a zero? I think so. So that's terminated. Take the 10, do it. Now this string is terminated as well already, so I should just output a zero, right? Yeah. Or should I? I am shit. I'm very confused right now. The game hasn't stopped. It's gonna probably tell me that I'm wrong. Yeah, yeah, it expected another zero. That's correct. Good. So this is bullshit, just like I said. So what I think we need to do is start the sum with this zero. So let's copy from the zero, copy to the sum. And in that case, we don't need this part. So we just inbox. If it's zero, we read from the sum. Otherwise, we add to the sum and repeat. Good. So I need to sort my jump here like that. And I'm going to call this zero. Okay, this should work. Take the zero. Start it as our sum, 3 goes there, repeat, 3 plus 3 is 6, place it down, repeat, inbox, that's a 0, so take it from there, and repeat, reset the sum, and go again. Okay, cool. So with these zeros, this one is gonna terminate this string, so it's gonna output 7. Then the other string, starting at 0, already terminated by this 0, so we're gonna output this zero. This zero terminates another zero string. So do it once more. Output another zero. And now we should just output the 18 and the game should be happy. Oh, 15. Okay, whatever. Yeah, that's it. It worked. Beautiful. And we completed the size challenge already, but it's a bit too slow. So we've used too many steps on average. So our goal could now be to clean up this code perhaps introduce more commands in order to make this person execute as few commands as possible. Is that possible? I don't think it is, uh, because I'm an idiot, obviously. So right now what I'm gonna do is the standard procedure, which I've always been told, and put the outbox first, just like that. So this code is identical, but the copy from and outbox goes first, and we just jump over it in the first iteration and then here once we inbox a zero we just jump back here so we no longer do that jumping back once a string is terminated so this jump no longer there every time we outbox but i think that's not going to be such an improvement right it's, it should still work the same way yeah so far seems to be working cool still 10 commands so we should still be with the side challenge. Yeah, we're okay. And let's see, 88. Yeah, so we skipped a few steps since last time because there was over 90. We need to skip a lot more. And I honestly don't know if that's possible. Well, clearly it is, but 
Man, I'm missing it. Why is there an exclamation mark? Tell me more. What's a zero terminated string? You can tell me, yeah? Go on. List of values, like one, two, three, four, five. Or, yeah, okay, I get it. And the string ends with a zero. Yes, I knew it. Sometimes a string can be empty. Yeah, yeah, so the middle string here, empty. Okay, I did get that. And a string cannot contain the number zero. That's right. Back to work, sure. This is shit. I mean, surely it's not possible to do this any more efficiently. Now, sadly, I don't think you can add here when there's no number, no nothing. Let me just try that. What if we inbox and add to the sum already? I think it's gonna fail because there's nothing to add to. Yeah, there you go, empty value. Just wanted to check that. Oh wait, actually I could introduce a few more commands, but get rid of some other. So I don't really like the copy from zero. Copy from zero, copy to sum. That's quite annoying. Could I say, you inbox a number. If it's a zero, you un outbox it right away. If it's not a zero, you copy it to sum and repeat. Or basically do this. So hopefully this should help with the empty strings a little, because you don't have to copy the zero to the sum. Yeah, does, does this work? Six goes there straight away, and now you inbox another number, edit, and just proceed normally. And we're no longer copying the zero there, so we're putting the first number down. Now, this is an empty string, so you inbox the zero, see it's a zero, and outbox it right away. Another zero, outbox right away. Now eight, so you just put it to the sum and keep inboxing in this loop again. I mean, that could be fewer steps. It's 11 commands in total, so longer code. But theoretically, come on, surely, please. Yes, yes, 68, nice. Now, I don't think there's a way to get rid of that extra command and maybe reach 72 steps, right? Is there? I don't think there is. Probably not. Yeah, screw it. I'll take that as a win. It's just so silly that, like, level 14, I couldn't complete the optional challenges. Level 17, 20, 22, and then 21, I just nail it. I'm actually quite proud.